Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants, where here we try to help you make that decision if it's going to change from a want to a need. If you are new to my channel, I really hope you will choose to subscribe. It's free and it's easy. It's the red button that you see right underneath this video. If you press it and it turns gray, you're in. It's that simple. There's also a bell beside that subscribe button that I always recommend that you press. It's called the notification bell. And what ends up happening is YouTube will notify you just once that I have uploaded a brand new video. I do upload a lot and sometimes my videos are time sensitive, so I don't want you to miss out. So make sure to press that subscribe button, ring that bell, and you'll be in the know. Also in that same area, there is that thumbs up, and that's where you guys come in. If you enjoy the content that I make, please take a second to hit that thumbs up. It will turn blue, the number will increase, and that's you helping True Ones get noticed on this huge YouTube platform. So I'm thanking you in advance for that thumbs up. Okay, guys, this is going to be a full weekend that hopefully you're subscribed to True Ones because I got so many of my boxes today. It is Saturday. And I decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to film as much as I can so that I can get all of this information up to you guys over this full weekend, simply because Monday is April the 11th and it is choice day. And hopefully the everything will be aligned and all the videotaping that I'm going to be doing will be able to be uploaded onto YouTube and you will be able to see all of the products. I do get on my channel two base boxes that I pay for as well as two premiums that I pay for. Today, when the delivery guy came, he was carrying so much stuff, I could not believe it. And I saw three black boxes in there. So I think I have two base boxes and one premium that I'll be able to share with you all the products that are inside. Uh, as you know, on my channel, what I do is I open up everything prior to, to be able to take a picture for Instagram. And then uh, if you're not following me there, I really hope that you do. It's True Once with the number two because I share a lot there. Also, if you don't get notifications, you'll be able to know through uh, the, the Instagram that I uploaded a video because I always post twice a day. I try on Instagram when I have a video and then the uh, everything that was inside the box. So, But on here, we get to swatch, we get to play, we get to see everything. And I'm, the reason I'm pushing myself so much to get all of this, and you'll be seeing this outfit because I'm not making outfit changes or anything. I wanna just sit down and film as much as I can so that we can get the products to see and be able to see the swatches of the products prior to Monday, which is when the drop shop opens. So that if anything is of interest to you and you don't get these boxes or you only get one box and not the other or whatever it is, there's so many products here that are ones that I haven't seen. I only saw one PR open because I thought I'd have all weekend to watch. I did not think that my paid versions would be coming at the same time that the people who get PR are showing their boxes. So all the information is going to be, uh, that is on the card will be in the description box down below as well as the variation number. But I wanna get to swatching and showing you everything that's in here. So make sure you're subscribed because I'm gonna be posting a lot this weekend and I really don't want you guys to miss out. We also have a giveaway going on right now that I always forget to mention it, but during the whole month of April, there is, you'll be able to sign up for it and watch it because uh, we're going to uh, get to the winner at the end of April because I had so many duplicates last month that I ended up having that giveaway that we did for Whole Foods that we already picked the winner. They've already received the products and they are so, so happy. But uh, then when I did my end of month where I open up everything on my Instagram, I could not believe how many products. So I decided I would do a second giveaway that we started the month with that giveaway. So if you haven't seen that video, I really hope that you do. It's a good one and I, it's for subscribers. So I go through all of that with you in the video. So uh, hopefully if you haven't uh, watched that yet, you will before the end of the month so that you can be entered. All right, let's get started because with the base box, this is a box that's under $30 and it is free ship in the USA and you get to choose one product. And because I have two boxes, I have the luxury of choosing different uh, choice items, hopefully in both boxes. If there are more choices that I want, sometimes the second choice or the third choice are not ones that I'm interested in. So sometimes I end up, and that's where a lot of the duplicates come in because I choose the same choice item. But this month, I think based on the first base box, when I did the pictures, I think there's only one duplicate in here, but don't hold me to it. So I think I have a lot that I'll be able to share with you guys. So starting with my choice item, which was for this box was from Beauty Bakery. This is the Sour Yeah Doing Eyeshadow Palette. These shades make your eyes squint and then light up in a surprise. It is a rich and bold yet soft for those who want to be supple. 
it says the sour yacht doing is perfect for your spring looks for date night and maybe even a holiday mixer they're saying this is a 38 dollars value and this is a brand new launch that we're getting in our boxes and i love that so this is from beauty bakery if you've never tried beauty bakery their shadows are really nice but their packaging on other things they had uh, beauty blenders that came like in an egg carton everything is on that bakery theme and then they have um i have their uh, loose setting powder that they call flower it is just absolutely fantastic so this is one that i'm really excited to dip my hands into this is the product here i did see uh one of the pr people that i watched uh, who get PR, they uh, showed this product and uh, they were very pleased with it as well. So I will swatch this at the end in case you've already seen it swatched. Uh, I want to make sure to leave this at the end so that you'll be able to see those swatches. This reminds me so much of one of my favorite palettes was my first pressed powder. I think it was the first one actually that that company did, uh, ColourPop. They had a palette that they came out with that was called Yes. And it was the first time that I got introduced to a yellow eyeshadow and it changed my world. So I cannot wait to swatch this at the end. That was what I was most excited for in this package. This, this item, I did not see any sneak peeks on it at all. This is from this brand called Aesthetica. It is a cream contoured kit. Now I'm not gonna swatch this one and normally I do is because I just received a cream contoured one last month from uh, I think it's called Iconic London, but this one is packaged so beautifully. It, this is the sleeve that it comes in here. On the back here, it has those gorgeous shades there. And then this is the card that is inside here. The packaging on this is beyond. This is called their um, Contour Series. That's what it says here. And inside here, they have a lot of information of where you should put it and then pictures of how to do it as well. I'm really, really impressed alone just with the packaging of this. This is really, really beautiful. And then we have the actual product here, which I will open up and show you. This one is, like I said, from the brand called Aesthetica. This is a $40 value on its own. And they're saying the kit contains six blendable silky creams that are designed to accentuate, define, and highlight your face contour shades for sculpting and three highlighted creams to enhance your favorite features. This kit includes removable and refillable pens. It's packaged in a travel-friendly mirrored palette, and it is specially formulated for fair to dark skin tones. So it's for everybody. So let me see, they said there was a mirror in here, so I'm gonna have to cover this up a little bit. Oh, wow. Inside here, they have, uh, their safety shield has actually, that is fantastic, has the actual, like that brochure did. So if you lose the brochure, this is always gonna be in your palette as a safety shield, and it's showing you where you should put your contours, your highlighters, and all of that. That is fan fantastic. And the shades look fantastic. They look like you could also use some of them for uh, concealers. It has that yellow shade for brightening, and then the darker tones to contour really really beautiful very very excited to get this like i said if i didn't uh get that london from iconic london this would be one that uh, i'd be swatching for you but because i just got that one and i haven't even played with it yet i'm gonna leave this in an area that i know that i have it but uh i'll see how i enjoy the cream contours from the other one because as you know with me i haven't really gone into the creams yet this is the one that I think is the only duplicate item. So this is the one that is from this box, but I left out on the table the one from my other uh, box here because I thought I saw a duplicate item and that is what this one is here. This is from Studio Makeup. It is the Hyaluronic Acid Rejuvenating Serum. And this penetrated into my skin really nicely, but I will swatch it here as well. And this one here is, because I don't know which video is gonna go up first, because you can film, in a certain order but then when everything gets uploaded and based on you know the iCloud and then YouTube you never know so this one is called studio makeup it is a hyaluronic acid rejuvenating serum they're saying the perfect serum for all ages it is a highly concentrated hyaluronic acid rejuvenating serum that works to quickly reverse the effects of dehydration and loss of elasticity while keeping the skin highlighted and moisturized throughout the day leaving the skin looking radiant and youthful. This is a $45 value on its own. And look how gorgeous the packaging is on this. You see the studio makeup over here, and then the other side has that it is the hyaluronic over there. Really, really beautiful. This is also, and let me see if um, I'll put it in. We have a big, big dropper here, so we'll be able to put it on. And it's going on very lightweight. 
So it is really, to me, feels a little bit more or looks a little bit more like uh, an essence, but it has a little thicker consistency to it. So to me, this is, I would put on right after the essence, or if you don't have essence, I would use this one first because it has more of a watery consistency. And the best way to know about how to layer skincare, you go from thinnest to thickest. So you start with essence, then serum, then your moisturizers. So we'll put this on here and we'll see how quickly this penetrates in. My skin is getting such treatments from all the boxes. I don't think my skin is, I'm gonna feel like a, a baby's button at the end of the day because I have never opened up so many boxes in one day. So this one here is this product, really excited about getting that. And this is a duplicate item, so that's even better. The next item in here is called the Flirtatious Looks Cosmetic. They're saying it is a dual foundation travel set. And this is the box that it came in. It is so beautiful. This is how it looks like here. That's this side and that's the back and then the other side here. And what it says on here, it says coverage, blendability and precision, quick beat versus mini base. It says step one, prep, step two, apply, step three, beat. And then it says coverage, precise blendability, so mini base and it says it's the flirtatious knockout are the team quick beat uh, mini base. When it comes to foundation application, and here it takes to enter your beat for a chance to be featured. Okay, da da da. All right, okay. All right, let's see what they wrote on the card about this because inside here, there is the cutest brush and uh, blender inside here. So this is also one that I have not seen yet. And this one says it is a flawless finish that lasts all day, beginning with the right tools. It is a perfect duo for this flirtatious look. This cosmetics is the essential foundation tool travel set featuring Quick Beat, a latex-free foam beauty sponge with a unique sharp tip and a flat edge. And the mini base is an exclusive travel size paddle that is shaped with a synthetic brush for with a shorter handle for even easier application. She's perfect for on-the-go glam. Both tools are key for a smooth application that melts onto your skin, especially those hard to reach places. And they're saying this is a $30 value. So this is, when I started with makeup, we used to use these type of foundations all the time because Beauty Blenders only came out a long time after that. So this is how we used to always place our foundation on. I haven't used my foundation brushes in such a long time. And um, I have so many of these sponges open. I'm gonna leave this one packaged for now, but I just wanted to see, cause I thought it was one that I can seal and unseal. Oh, I can. Okay, I'm gonna open it. So this one here, so I can tell you what it feels like. So. What I suggest is if you don't want to do the two steps, if you know, you're like me and we put our foundations right onto our beauty blenders or directly onto our face, or you know, a lot of girls who do it with their fingertips, I would suggest a brush better over a fingertip. But these are also great when you get those clay masks. That's what I use a lot of these brushes for now that I have sitting that are the foundation brushes. So if you don't want to put foundation on with this and you, you, know, you put it directly onto a beauty sponge and you don't want this extra step, I always suggest you use this as a mask uh, tool. So that is what this looks like here. And it's very soft, but firm. So it's really good even to put the masks on. And this one has those perfect, it feels uh, really uh, very spongy. It feels more like um, very, very soft. Uh, like the, the fabric that's on here, the way the sponge is made. And then it has the flat surface, it has the tip, and it has the bounce uh, on the round bottom, which is what the Beauty Blender is like. But it's always great to get a flat surface because I find the flat surfaces work the best for me. This is the same shape as the one that I love, which is from Juno, which is a microfiber. This is not a microfiber, but it feels completely different than uh, another sponge this is uh, gonna have a lot of bounce to it. So really excited about that. Did not see that one coming, so excited about that. And then the last item that is in here was my choice item last month, but in a different shade. So excited about that. And it was it at, in, in my Ipsy bag. And this is a beauty vault. And this one is a matte liquid lipstick and a lip liner. And the one that I got in this box, it says on here on the end, it says it's called the Erupt Lip Set. However, when I opened it, the names on the bottom of this were different than here. And I also brought out to the desk the one that I got in, so we'll be able to see the color difference. This one is uh, that I got in last month's Ipsy. This one is the lip set includes a liquid, liquid matte lipstick and a lip liner to create a full luxurious lip look. This is $18.50 for the two pieces. 
and this one is in Natty Nat, and the lip liner is in Carmen. So like I said, in the other one, it was called Bubbly, and the shade and the pencil were the same name. So this one's a little bit different than what it says on the actual box. So let's open this up and see what the shade looks like here. And these really stayed on the lips. So this is the type that you need, um, like this type of product that uh, takes anything off that I find hard to take off. I find this spray oil makes the biggest difference. And I leave it on the counter here so that today, especially because I'm filming a lot, I'm using it in between to wipe off all the swatches and it's behaving beautifully. And then this one has a gel eyeliner, uh, gel lip liner on it and the match is close. And this is what this one looks like here. So that is the shade that's here. This is really a deep shade to be put into, to me, uh, a spring box. But the color that I got from Ipsy is more up my speed, but I will show that one to you as well. So that is what this one looks like here. And this one is called Bubbly. And this was a great deal because this one, I think I was able to choose as my choice item in my $13 bag. So really, really great uh, in Ipsy that I was able to get this there too. So that top one is the one that is from Ipsy and the bottom one is the one that I just got in this box today. Now let's do the swatches of this fantastic palette that I cannot wait to get my hands on. And it comes with a beautiful, beautiful full mirror. I'm pretty sure I showed you guys this and it has that safety shield and those are the colors there. And we'll just do some quick swatches. These are the colors that I gravitate to all the time. So we have pink lemonade, sangria, as well as sweet. So we have pink lemonade, sangria, and sweet. Yeah, they're beautiful. That is really, really pretty. And Beauty Bakery, like I said, their packaging, this is like tame compared to the packaging that we normally get. And I have a wet, um, cloth here and a dry towel right beside it so that we can try to get as much of the colors being exactly what they are in the pan here. So we have Refresher, I think it says Bellini Me, and then Tarte. And like I said, this is reminding me so much of if you were part of ColourPop at the beginning during all the hype when I could not wait to get my hands on because I'm not a single shadow girl. So when ColourPop came out with the palettes, now they're coming out with palettes every other day. That was the first one and it was called Yes. And I took it on a trip with me and I literally could not get enough of it. This one is called Chocolates, this is Sour, and this is Icing. Do you see what I mean by the names? They are just as perfect. It's everything that you would find in a bakery. And this last one is stunning. And those are all the colors there. So these went on that I really feel you can build them. They're easy, to, if you're newer to eyeshadow, you'll be able not to have to worry about blending too, too much. But I think these are, is gonna be a palette that I will definitely uh, be playing with. And really, I think fantastic for spring. And you can get all those sunrise looks. But to me, those pops of colors, I love that they have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six mattes and only three of those satin shimmer shades so that you're able to get all the looks out of it. And that's everything in reference to the BoxyCharm Base Box. But like I said, I'm gonna have two of them on the channel and two of them that I'm gonna to try to get up over the weekend because I think I only had one duplicate item, which is fantastic. And then you guys will be able to see um, a lot more products and be able, like I said, to make that decision on the drop shop day, which is Monday. So don't forget choice is Monday for BoxyCharm at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time, April 11th. And then right after that, the drop shop opens. And that's it for today, guys. So don't forget to watch all the videos because like I said, there is so much that came in today and I'm gonna be filming and filming and filming to try to get all up over the weekend. So like I said, just keep your eyes on it. If not, just keep coming back and checking to see what new video I just posted. All right, take care everybody, stay well, and I'll see you all soon in my next one. Bye for now.